Um, so anyways, I've got mine built. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, what's poppin' okay. party people? It's your girl J-Dog and my fiance, I'm my fiance. <laughs> um, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome. My name is Jalen, but you can just call me J-Dog. So for today's video, me and my fiance are making a gingerbread house. And you know what's kind of cute? This is the last time that we made a gingerbread house. We were just like girlfriend and boyfriend, but now we're like fiance. Oh, now we're engaged. So yeah. Next that, that time cool. we make a gingerbread house, we're gonna be like married. Yeah. Steps. Steps. All the steps. <laughs> so we got these from Walmart, and hopefully while you're watching this, they still have them because they they be selling out pretty quick. Yeah. So if you're watching this and you're into this, go now, run. Well, after the <laughs> after the video. Last time we did it, we got everything like individual. Like we went and got. Oh yeah, gingerbread or. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. The graham crackers. Graham crackers, graham crackers and we got like M&M's. Yeah. Why did I just smell the lid? <laughs> Babe. Yeah, we did it the hard way. The so drops and the gumdrops or whatever. This is cheating. It's got everything in there for you. They had a big variety of I'm not doing instructions. From. No? No. You're just gonna go for I'm it. I'm going for it. Why? Oh no, Why? I mean, I'm gonna go for it too, but they're just showing you like what you have in here. Like the little kit and whatnot. But I got the Barbie one. Did I already say that? Yes, yeah, got the Barbie. Okay, I got the Barbie one. Dream house. The Barbie cookie dream house. And Cheech got yeah. it's a this... pre built gingerbread kit. So I think Which it... is cheating, but it is what it is. I hope it doesn't come already built. I don't think so, but I did kind of look a little bit because me and Sarah, my best friend, we're gonna make one too. And I looked. And it comes with like a house and you basically glue the pieces on. I didn't know that until after I bought them, but Yeah, I, I think this is already built. I think I'm just decorating. Well it's not built yet. They have like a little like it says it's pre assembled. Like the Look right here. There's no way. The kit contains one pre baked, pre assembled gingerbread house. What? Yeah, so we're gonna find out right now. Oh but no! <laughs> we didn't read. <laughs> we don't read. <laughs> we assembled. But so now we read. We'll find out. Well, the one that me and Sarah have that has like a little plastic house, and then uh, you put the um, what's it called? Gingerbread. What's it called? Yeah, the gingerbread. The like the walls are on the it. walls. You like. Yeah, no, it's it. already built. Dude, that is the lamest thing I've ever even heard. So um. Maybe I should do the Paw Patrol. And I'm calling the cops. Yes, do the Paw Patrol. Yeah, I'll do the Paw Patrol. This is gonna be good. This, this is gonna be good. <laughs> I can't believe that's pre-made. You are weird. Mint, I got some gumdrops. We don't need these. Goodbye, goodbye. Okay, so we gotta massage it until it's soft. I was worried we were gonna have to warm it up. Massage it yeah. it's soft. Okay, yours looks like you got a lot more work to do though. You think so? Yeah, like what, you've got these bags. This like, is a piping bag, but I'm yeah, probably not, not going to use it. They're not even ready to uh, go. I'm probably not going to pipe it, anything. You I'm only probably... have one color? Yeah. I just get white. What? You want to borrow my pink? <laughs> no, no. Maybe while we're massaging, we can like ask each other like fun questions. Alright, well I have a question. Okay. Like, what is your favorite thing about the holiday season? Family time, for me. That's what I'm thinking. Family like, time. especially when we have kids, like, that's going to be the complete vibe. Like, family yeah. time. Like, we could do anything. Watching TV, like, all posted up in the living room or, like, anything. I think for me, my favorite thing for when we have kids mm -hmm. is going to be, like, the whole, like, Santa thing. And so, like, like we were talking about mm -hmm. the other day, where, like, we go and we hide, like, you know, wait till the kids go to bed, hide all the presents like, under the tree and, like, Got to keep the presents hidden all year yes. so that they don't see them. Yeah. And I'm definitely going to be that type of parent where, like, I'm getting presents all year and just, like, stacking them up. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because then, like, it's not all... Because if they go to the store with you around holidays, they kind of see what all is out. You know what I mean? Mm. But, like, if you're doing it all year, like, it's going to be a surprise for them. You right. know what I mean? They're going to be Yeah. Because yeah. it's not going to be all the same stuff that's out right then. Right. So I definitely want to do that, too, where I'm, like, getting it all year. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna go so ham. So ham, so ham. It's almost like a bad thing. Mm -hmm. I feel like our kids are gonna be so spoiled. I grew up not celebrating Christmas, so I feel like even more so now, like I'm gonna go even crazier. Yeah, yeah, I definitely celebrated Christmas. We gotta show them the little tree too. Well, you're probably gonna do it, but you already did a video on mm -hmm. that. It's already up. 
Mark it's already it posted. Go check it out. I decorated the whole house. I mean, as you can see, we got a little bit of stuff going on over here. <laughs> but I decorated the whole house. Well, not the bathroom, but the living room and the bedroom work, work are matters. pretty festive. Yeah. I mean, I don't. Most people probably don't decorate their bathroom I, festive. I, I mean, they, they probably do. do. <laughs> I think probably they have do. like some festive like soap dispensers and stuff like that. But like, I found a rug at. Um, yeah, probably a rug. Burlington that I was about to get, but how weird would it be just to decorate the bathroom with just a rug? Well, we almost got a shower curtain too. Yeah, but that yeah. was a whole different day. Whole at the, different at the day. time, I was like, day. all I'm gonna do is a rug. Yeah. So I didn't, we didn't end up going for it. Maybe next year. I think I'm probably massaged enough here. Yeah, I kind of forgot. I gotta do this one now. Oh no. Okay, so we got more questions. <laughs> okay. Um. What's like, what's like one activity that you feel like for kids, you want to make it like a, what's it called? Like a, like a tradition? A tradition, yeah. What's something that you want to make into a tradition for like the holidays? Um, that's a really good one. That's a really good one. I think for sure I want to do a secret Santa with the kids just mm -hmm. so that they can like get a sense of like being generous without like having to have it be like known, like getting credit for it type of thing. Cause mm -hmm. like, I don't really want to do a secret Santa where like, you know who gave it to you either. Like, I think like you should just like get a gift under the tree and it was from somebody, whoever, and it just says from your secret Santa, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And that's how we do it. And like, it should be like a way of teaching them like not to like have to get credit or like be known for being generous type yeah. of thing, but like just to do it to like, feel good yeah but I, I think that would be a cool way of doing like a cool little tradition I think so I was thinking which I don't know if it would like I guess but I was thinking um like um what's it called like theme parks going to like I know there's like probably only so many theme parks but if you went to like a different like theme park every year around Christmas well, there's... time there's thousands because you can go all around the world too yeah My so i feel like that would be pretty cool like going like even if we've never been there before just to go there around christmas and mm -hmm. see what it's like yeah, my uncle, the one that was here the other day, he's gone and ridden the top 100 roller coasters around the world. Really? Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, he was, he's really into roller coasters and amusement parks and stuff. All right, I think I'm ready. All right, what is, what is this? This is cookie. <laughs> oh, this is definitely the ground. Well, this is the ground. Well, this is the floor then. Is it? Yeah, this is a floor. Are you sure? What else would it be? A wall. Because otherwise you only have three walls. <laughs> what? So I'm supposed to break this? Yeah, I think it's three different walls. I mean, look at your instructions. No. Yeah. It's cheating. <laughs> Let's see. No, I think you gotta break it. What is this? I think it's different walls. <laughs> <laughs> Babe. I think it's different walls. Yeah. And like, what are you for? Are you the door? Are you the I chimney? I think those are different pieces too. Oh my gosh. I'm all like saying like, oh my God, that sucks so bad that and we can't. I think this is two different pieces. <laughs> I was complaining two seconds ago about this, like them basically doing it for us. Now I'm mad because I have to break these pieces. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't want to build, but she wants to build. What? All right. <laughs> Get the instructions out, girl. <laughs> okay, yeah. we, we gotta break stuff for sure. Oh my god, they literally have like numbers for each dude. They're weird. I mean, I don't think you need to go that far. I think, so look, you can pretty much see. So like, this one here, you break it in half. Like, I, I See this one? So look. Oh my god, they are not. I'll, I'll let you do it, I don't wanna break it, but like. Oops, I'm dropping your beads. And these are windows? No, no. Those no, are... so, I, well, it might be. It's the side of the house. Yeah, see? they're windows. So, like, that one goes on this side, and that one goes on that side. And then these are pieces of roof. These are the three roofs. Because see how this is? So you've got... Oh, these are for a flower box. Are I was they? like, what are these for, though? Yeah, it's for a flower box. <laughs> like... Is it not the steps? Yeah, steps and flower box. These are steps? Yeah, part part of it's steps and part of it's flower box. <laughs> Dude, 
Steps. All right, it's fine. All right, here we go. Do that. You got it. Oh, maybe we should still ask each other questions. I'm we down. I'm time. definitely down. I, I would like that actually. Um, so I guess it's my turn now because you asked me about a tradition. Yeah. Um, so I guess my question would be then, what do you think is a good amount of money to spend on Christmas gifts? <clears throat> like all together, like per let's do like per kid. That way it's kind of fair. You know what I mean? Man, well, okay. I was gonna say, but this sounds ridiculous because I was gonna say like 500 to a thousand uh -huh. just because I feel like we'll get t at least like two items per kid that are kind of like a more expensive item. Like yeah. one thing for me that I was thinking specifically that'd be like, I'm getting this 100% when they're like closer to the age is one of those like cars that they can get in yeah. and drive around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, yeah. I feel like those aren't very um, inexpensive. Like, those are probably, like, a bit. Not, like, a bunch, but... Well, so, like, you can go to the flea market. Ed bought one for uh, Josh. Mm -hmm. And it was, like, I think he paid 120 bucks for one. Oh, of... really? Yeah. That's not scary. I think it was a car. Really? I thought it was the dogs. I thought it was a car. Um, but anyways, yeah, they're, I mean, they can be, it depends on how much you want to, you know what I mean? Yeah. Because I remember when I was working at Tesla, you could buy one for your kids at Tesla. Yeah. And it was like 300 bucks or something like that. But it was a little mini Model S or X. Kind of cool if you had one, but you know what I mean? But. Well, in tarnations. Um, so anyways, I've got mine built. <laughs> Anyways, okay. I can't even figure out how to get this open. I think you might need some scissors, love. Yeah, you need scissors. You're weird. Um, I mean, if you stand up, you might be able to grab one of my knives, check here, and I can cut it for you. Are you sure? Yeah. A knife? Mhm. Mm They're all closed. Huh? They're all closed. I'll, I'll just cut it open. Yeah, all but right. you're not gonna like cut your little fingers off. No. She's got a big butt. <laughs> Realistically, I don't think 500 to 1,000 is unrealistic at all. I was an only yeah. child when I was a kid, so I was really spoiled. And I had really expensive Christmases when they were available, like, easy to us, when it was something that could be done. And um, But so anyways, um, I mean, realistically, it just comes down to what you're able to spend he's gonna spend all of his money <laughs> when, they, when they get older and if it's around the same time like maybe get them a car for christmas if it's around the same time that they would get their license or something like that like yeah. i think that would be really cool yeah so i mean like for me like it, it, it's all situational and depends on your financial stability and yeah i mean i guess when you were saying that i was thinking of like straight up like children though because i yeah, feel like when they do kids, get older like yeah well, spending a little bit more money because like a like school and like if they needed like a laptop for school or something like when you're a kid you're not gonna need a laptop you know what i mean no what's something that you're like i don't know why it's all about kids right now but <laughs> we've been talking about this a lot um what's one thing that you're like the most excited about having kids um honestly i think like seeing what like hobby or sport or whatever it mm -hmm. is that they most get into that's exactly what i was gonna say I, I think that's like what i'm most excited just to see like what makes them tick you know what i mean yeah for me it's like not necessarily being like okay what are they interested in but like being there and being involved in it yeah just sounds like fun like yeah 100 percent too on that like if they get into like dance cheer or for the boy or i mean honestly i don't care if they're a boy and they're doing cheer or whatever but i, I don't either yeah. in general like what they're into it's just going to be cool to be there yeah and be them. involved yeah yeah, yeah i just want to be and I, i'm definitely the kind of person where like i want to be like a coach yeah like i wanted to get involved but i was never able to play like sports in high school or 
just in school in general. Mm -hmm. So I feel like that's going to be so cool to be able to like cheer on your kids, let them do whatever the fuck they want. You know, mm -hmm. like if they want to do sports, then that's cool. If they want to be like into music and all that kind of thing, yeah, then that's whatever cool. Like whatever they want to do, I'm just like excited to like support yeah. them. My dad was really good about that. Like he definitely, whatever I wanted to do, like he was going to be there mm -hmm. and take me to my practices and my rehearsals. Like, for chorus, like, I went to every rehearsal, whether it was after school or whatever. Mm -hmm. And, like, I mean, yeah, like, he drove me to everything. Football practice, football games. Was at pretty much every one of my football games when I played football. And when I was growing up, I mean, he was very active in my baseball. He would take me to the batting cages all the time. Mm -hmm. So I want to be like that, you know? Right. Because, like, those are the kind of things that your kids remember and then they do for their kids, you know? Yeah. We are instilling that in them for, like, the future. Yeah. Sorry, I'm not laughing at you. <laughs> I'm just... I'm laughing at your windows? Laughing at whatever these are supposed to be. It's it's not really... Coming out the way you Coming thought. out, like, the picture. <laughs> yeah, mine has, like, snow dripping all down the side of it. Is that what that is? That's what we're going to call it. Okay. It's white, so it's snow. <laughs> yeah, this isn't good. This is not good. I bet you there's like a six-year-old out here that like made like a masterpiece and we're just like completely butchering it. From over there though, it don't look that bad. It looked like I should be doing this for a living or something. We caulking. We caulking out here. Maddie's just gonna be like, girl. Yeah, <laughs> she's a bro. That's not even a fair comparison. My best friend Maddie decorates cakes for a living. So if you're watching this, bestie boo. Uh, well, I was trying to fill this spot up here and it just ran because I massaged it too good. <laughs> All right, we're done with the windows. Let's decorate the top. You know what I'm going to do? Oh, look how much more icing I have. Like, I feel like I got like, like 12 toaster strudels left right here. Toaster strudels? Yeah, this is a toaster strudels. It's because they did like, they like piped it all over the place. Dude, children are buying this. You're silly. You're silly for that. Yeah, they like went real fancy, you know, and like. This was supposed to be a flower box and steps, but we don't need either. So I'm gonna make a chimney. I kinda just wanna like Chimney? suck all the icing out of this, but that's like <laughs> the little kid in me. Yeah, you don't have very much icing though. Are you done decorating? No, whoa, 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 I still got so much candy I gotta yeah. put on this thing. I'm just saying, like, it, it's, like, so tempting. Yeah. The icing just, like, screams your name. It does. It's, like, when I used to eat toaster strudels, I, like, started trying to, like, eat toaster strudels without the icing. So you can have just all the icing? Well, so that I could put more icing on, like, the beginning ones. Like, put, like, double, like, two packs uh, on each one. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Just because, like, I wanted more icing on one. So yeah. I was, like, okay, I'm going to try to get used to them without it so that okay. I can go ham on the first ones. What? Yeah, weird kid. Uh oh oh did i just a touch dude this sweater dude it it won't it ah, ah. it's all right i'm gonna eat it so. you're gonna eat that heck yeah what in the you're not gonna eat yours i mean i'll eat some of it but this is a tummy ache for well, sure you don't eat it all at once yes you do no you don't where, you... where are you gonna put that in the fridge sister they're weird what i don't do you... think do people normally just eat it that's why it's all edible, love. Door. We're piping, Maddie. We're piping. <laughs> She's like, sort of. Yeah, it's a piping hot steaming mess doo doo. <laughs> <laughs> That's what mine is. Um, okay, so. This is a, th a thing I've been thinking, a question I've been thinking in my head a lot lately. Okay. Not about you specifically or anything, just like in general. Okay. Um, what is your favorite color for a car? I've been having a hard time thinking of, because, like, my favorite color is, like, bright green, right? But I don't necessarily think that that's, like, a good color for a car. Right. You know what I mean? Like, that would be my first pick for a color for a car. For me, listen, this is what it is for me. Black. Because if you're, if you're like, for me, my favorite color is yellow. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, that could change at any time, but... Like if it's black, you can decorate the inside any way that you like. So if you mm -hmm. want like the fluffy yellow steering wheel cover, mm -hmm. you can do that. But if you get like a, a red car or like a blue car and you have like a yellow 
situation going on inside mm -hmm. that's just like weird you know i feel like black i feel like black 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 is just sick you know mm -hmm. like black everything like at the interior like everything black. black on black on black yes and like i think like so like a um like the wheels what are they called the rims the rims like matte rims or something mm -hmm. matte black rims would be sick. What do, okay, so what do you think though for a car? Um, so it depends on the kind of car a little bit for me. Yeah. Like whether it's a classic car or it's a new car or whatever, mm -hmm. a little bit. But mm -hmm. um, I, honestly, I think I really like like a red with like some metal flake in it or blue with metal flake in it. Um. And with tan interiors, mm -hmm. I like tan interiors inside cars, like what we got in the Ford right now. Mm -hmm. Or maybe even older. I think it's like 18 or something. Yeah, that sounds They have fun. like a, a, one of the buildings there is built completely out of driftwood from like the coast. <laughs> you talking crap to Millie. <laughs> but yeah. Okay, here's mine. My chimney. It's a very fancy chimney. I think so, too. I actually am not mad at all. Like, check out this. No, yeah, you did pretty good, dude. Check out this piping, Maddie. <laughs> <laughs> Mine just has okay. icing slathered everywhere. And then it's it's snowing outdoors, though. Yeah, it's so snowing. There's icicles. Keep that in mind. It's snowing. And... <laughs> and we put lights all over the roof. The light, yeah, the lights. And a gumdrop just fell. Are your gumdrops on the back of the house? Yeah, well, they were. That was gonna be the front, but like as the gumdrops wouldn't stay, I decided to like decided switch the house switch around. Switch around. You're yeah. gonna see it though. Oh, you're gonna go there. <laughs> it's, it can't be worse than my back. <laughs> Check out that piping, Maddie. Sick. All right. Well, yeah, we're done here. But who do y'all think has the better one? What do you Tell think? us in the comments. Yeah. Make sure you leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget that. Never forget to subscribe. Never forget that. What do you think? If you subscribe, think? I'll come find you. Yeah, don't unsubscribe. That's <laughs> weird. That's weird. Why do people do that? It's fine. It's fine. I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad about it. Who do you think has the better one? Mine's so girly and festive, and it's really cute. Well, I mean, considering yours doesn't have pieces falling off of it, <laughs> I think you win. You think? Yeah, I think she wins. But tell us in the comments. I mean, I if you think I won, I'm not going to fight you. You won't. You probably won't. I, I like that. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like Cheech said, like this video, subscribe my channel. Don't forget to do that. Comment below. We're doing Vlogmas, my people. So comment below what you'd like to see during Vlogmas. And then we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.